Well, that's a positive way to start our journey. We spoke them on the start. They're still there. They, they went a little bit into the left. Here. Oh, right here, right here. <laughs> oh, there they are. Oh, right here. Well, we're out on another dive trip with Doc today. Beautiful way to start the day. There's dolphins right there inside the channel. Doc and Tony. We got, you guys remember Bullet Tooth Tony, AKA Machine Gun Tony. A brother from another mother. <laughs> hey, Machine Gun Tony Doc. In, in Rhoda, he shot so many wow, fish wow. on his stringer. Everyone's like, holy cow, you got a machine gun down there? Wow. Yeah, amazing. That's a good nickname. Yep. So, we're heading out diving again today. Wish us luck. Make sure you hit that thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. Preparing for battle. Here we go. Looking for a fun time here. It's already fun. Time's away, bro. All right, as usual, while the boys are in the water diving, we'll be doing a little bottom fishing on the top. But today, Don Pedro forgot the reels in the truck, so luckily we have one on board. We'll see what kind of damage we can do with one reel today. Wish us luck. All right, guys, while the boys are diving, we're bottom fishing and we're hooked up. Yes, what you think you got? A fishy or something? All right, we got color. Keep it coming, keep it coming, keep it coming. You got one or two. You got one, two, my footy. Go down, Pedro. Oh, what do we got here? What do you got to say to all your subscribers? <laughs> oh, it happens to the best of us, son. The only way you're going to feel better is if you jump in the water, I'm telling you. He doesn't want to listen guys, but the only way I personally think you feel better when you're really nauseous on a boat, especially on a hot day like this, is to cool down. Jump in the water, you'll feel better. You should know better, son. You're experienced out here. All right guys, there's more dolphins. Okay, we got three hooks on this line, so we're gonna try and get more than one. That's like pretty small dolphins. The dolphins are on the boat. This is awesome. See what you got? Get my dad back. Ooh, another got him. Another... Get in, get in, get in, get in, get in, get in. All right, he's throwing up on the side of the boat. We hook up and he's got to get back to work. Uh, he's not feeling good today, but hey, we're all the way out here fishing. He knew what he was getting himself into when he got in the boat this morning. All right, we're gonna send it back down again. Go ahead and put the sinker in the water, son. Wish us luck on this drop, y'all. Here we go. Are you throwing up again? No? All right, sinker just reached the bottom. I'm gonna go ahead and close this pool, bring it up just a tad bit. Oh, it just took the bait though. That one didn't get stuck. It was a nice bite though. There we go. There's a nice bite. You see it? Y'all see the rod bend? Check it out. Check it out. Look at it. Look at the vibration. 
All right, we know he's there if it tugs back when I pull up. All right, it's there. Here we go. Coming up, check it out. Panapa! We got Don Pedro C sticking over there. And fish hooked up right here. Ooh, it's a fighter, huh? Look at that, look at that rod done. Look at that. Look at that, y'all. What is it, son? My food piece, you see it? All right, Dom Pedro, get it in the boat. All right, let's see if we can hook up real fast for you again on this one. All right, we just touched the bottom. I'm gonna bring it up just a tad bit off. All right, got a nice bite there. Look at the rod tip, watch rod tip. All right, there we go, hooked up. Hooked up, y'all, hooked up. Dom Pedro, you wanna fight this one? Or you want me to do it? I can do it? All right, guys, hooked up, we're coming home. Here we go. Good fighter again, this one. What we got, Don Petro? What we got? All right, looks like we got two here. Come on. Nice. There we go. Well, looks like we finally found a spot to pick up on some fish, so we'll, we'll start videoing again a little bit. I'm going to save some of this battery, but... It's nice to see Don Pedro back to work and not throwing up off the side of the boat. Smash that like button if you think Don Pedro's a trooper. Feeling seasick off his game today, but he's still fishing to provide food for the family. Right, boy? All right, guys. We got a new crew. Check it out. Woohoo! Winner, winner. We got Uku for dinner. Check it out. This is the one. Guys, the boys coming up. We're gonna check what they got. Can you get the gun? Yeah. Buy something else again, right? Yeah. Oh, wow. Oh, Bobby Stringer. <laughs> Check it out, boys. Awesome. Hold up, hold up your string it up. Okay. Hold it up, hold it up, hold it up. Oh, no sharky following you, huh? Yes, yes but it didn't tax you. Uh, no, oh, we, uh, I went back to my... Hey. <laughs> Woo-hoo! Good job, Doc. Hey, I'll go bus. Hey. Check it out. All right. Quality catch here in Luta, nice. baby. Nice, nice. <laughs> good job. Yeah. Check it out. It was a good day. Check out Doc's day. fish. All oh, big fatties. <laughs> Check out some, some big ones. Nice. And a lot of quality. Good variety. Good variety. Machine gun Tony. And oh, yeah. Doc, I got to get you a nickname, man, because you kill fish, dude. Oh, yeah. Who was diving after a, such a long yeah, way? A, uh, a long, yeah, a long yeah. break. Sure oh, man. I know, right? It was good to be in the water. Crazy, right? I, uh, I almost oh. had my gills dry out. <laughs> thank you. Good to have you. And thanks for being there for Doc, yeah, bro. Yeah, thank you. Thank we you. really don't want you in the water yeah. solo. Oh, even thanks. though we always. know you can handle your I own. Can do it. I've been doing we it do years. not oh, want that. Oh, thank always. you. Always, thank always. You. Guys, practice thank safe you. diving. Uh, always wife, have a buddy happy about that. with you. Right? My wife, he always tells me. Don't worry, Lucy. We take care of him when he's out here. Right, Doc? Right on. That's All a right. really blue one. Yeah. Good job, boys. Awesome. This, this is for you, Don Pedro. Beautiful fish. Look at that. It's 12 16 already. You guys, oh, were, over. you guys were swimming for four hours, wow. believe it or not. Wow. That's, That's amazing. Four awesome. hours worth of swimming. You, guys, awesome. you guys are in shape, though. That's all That's I got to awesome. say. Yeah. Good, Good job. job, brother. Good job. Man. Not bad for doing an O nighter, huh? Not bad at all. Yeah. yeah, Tone just came out from a 20 hour Crazy. shift. You know? He, he protects and serves. He keeps us safe right out there on, in the right streets. On. You know? Woo. Shout out to GPD. Right on. Thank you. Thank you. All right, guys. Get some sugar, get some water in you, and yeah, hopefully you have a nice boat ride home. Here we go. All right. So we're back at the dock, and now you know what time it is. We're going to cook up one of the fish, actually a couple of the fish that we caught on our adventure today uh first thing i'm gonna do is cut some onions prep my sauce for some parrot fish we're gonna wrap on the foil and put in this here grill check this out y'all hey, check this out okay 
We just use salt and pepper on the fish, mayo and kimchi base in the mix. The topping that's missing is really what I wanted to show that's different. Um, you guys might see this part, but you wouldn't see the, the topping that we do with the sausage. Now that's, that's our... Uh, that's our jam. That's the game changer. Yeah, that that's uh, the best one that we use is a uh, Spanish chorizo sausage. You're not seeing it in this video, but I'm going to keep mentioning it because it makes this dish all the better. Uh, our good friend over here, PJ, he was in charge of getting me all the ingredients I needed, and obviously he foul ball. Him and Kiwi are best friends. Y'all remember Kiwi, he's the one who forgot the rice. <laughs> so PJ forgetting the sausage for this ain't so bad because his best friend's Kiwi who forgot the rice. They're like two peas in a pod. All right, check it, right? Salt, pepper, onion, garlic. We don't have the sausage. I'm getting the fish right now. So we're gonna layer this, okay? Check this out. I'm gonna learn you guys for a minute, okay? Uncle, cool. learn you how. I'm gonna learn we'll you how we'll in case it spills. Okay, check it. We're gonna put our fish in the center of the foil, all right? What we're gonna, you'll see when I'm done, we're gonna wrap it. Anyway, I'm just gonna score it like this. That way the sauce gets inside the fish. All right, check it. Once again, we're missing the infamous sausage that would have made this all the better. I'm gonna stuff it with onion inside. Nice. All right, would have been good if it was stuffed with onion and sausage, but once again, Kiwi's best friend, PJ, he forgot that part of the ingredient. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and just baste it like this. Check this out. Then we're gonna open it up and get some of the sauce inside. Check it out. Just like that. I know this is a little messier than you guys are used to seeing me, but it's been a long day and I'm still kind of upset that we don't have the sausage. <laughs> gonna flip it over just like that. All right, we're gonna do the same thing on this side. I don't know about you guys, but I love onions. They make me cry, they make me happy. They taste oh so good. They also add a little crunch to your dish. You know what I mean? All right, check out this technique, okay? Check this out, guys. We're gonna come up and up. Then we're gonna pinch and fold. Just like so. We're gonna tuck and fold again. One more time to keep it tight. the next fish get it ready for the grill start the grill up and we'll get started all right we'll see you guys soon so what is this all right check this out this was an awesome birthday gift i got this year from one of my great friends shout out to ryan warner show him how it's done turn and push yeah. Woo, look at that look at that low heat so we're gonna let the grill warm up for a bit and then we're gonna put our fish on it our fish in the foil I don't know if you guys can see, but this grill is sitting on a rod holder on my cutting station. This thing is that awesome. That used to be a bait, what is it called? Yeah, this was a live wall. It was a bait tank on my boat. It, it had a seat, uh, bait tank and everything, but I needed more fishing room, so we took this out. We don't really use live bait on Guam anyway, so I didn't have much use for it. Check it. Um, yeah, we're gonna get the fish on it. All right, check this out. All right, so it's not a Traeger, but it does the job. <laughs> We'll put this one in the back and I'll make the next fish ready for the front. We're going to close this and let it steam and get started on my next fish. All right, and we're back with Buddy. All right, guys. So we're going to do a, uh, a lemon beer uh, steam for this one, right? So we scored it already, but for the bigger fish, you usually score it like this, but for the bigger fish, you want to score one across too, right? Because there's a lot of meat. Just like that, just like so. And then we'll make a bowl, kind of a bowl shape or like like a plate shape with the uh, with the foil. We'll hold in the fluids. Just like so. All right, y'all. Now you want to use a fresh beer because you don't want you don't want to use the beer that you've been drinking, especially with COVID going around. 
right? All you do is go one round of soy sauce mm. and one round of beer, just like that. You can throw a little more down. Yeah. Okay. And then one more time for good luck. Yeah. <laughs> and then we'll turn it around and do the same thing on the other side. Right. So we got our onions up on top, and then we're just gonna cover it and finish it off with some lemons before we seal it up. Right. Now that's beer, soy sauce, onions, and lemons. And now we'll seal it up. It was a birthday gift. All right, let's get it in there. Flame, can you assist? This fish is done. We're gonna get it on the cooler table, open it up, and see what's good. You're gonna put it there and then put it down? Yeah. Cool, come, come. And we're gonna feed the village. Yeah. Woo, this is gonna be We're gonna ready? feed the boat base and bandit. <laughs> the fish is cooked, moment of truth. We got our taste testers here. Which one do you wanna try first, the parrot fish or the god owl? Parrotfish? Alright, we're gonna go with the parrotfish, guys. Here we go. Oh, this is hot, y'all. Check it out. We're about to get in on this. Look at that. Oh, that aroma. Ask them how it smells. How's it smell here? That's not fish, that's crab. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we got Tommy Boy here. He, as you can see, is a very healthy man. He will tell you if this is good. He'll give you the honest yeah. truth. Here we go. Try to sell. All right. We're gonna eat this crab. <laughs> oh my God. Hi, look at that. Netflix, here I come. <laughs> so good. So good. Here I come, Netflix. Nice. Flaky, good, not too dry. Very moist, very good. Flavor, good, good flavor. Flavor is so good, it's not overpowered by anything. It's great. Awesome. Awesome. <laughs> and that, don't worry. Don't worry. Any day now, guys. DJ will soon be done. So this was that beer, lemon, onion, and soy sauce marinade. Check it out. Oh, that's so nice. Okay. PJ's gonna be our taste tester, the one who forgot the sausage. I got sausage for you guys. <laughs> Keep it PG for the kids, bro. My bad. Good. Yeah? Is it really good? Yeah. You heard it right there, and now we're going to enjoy. Well, hey, I'll tell you guys what. That's the best part about fishing for us is not just catching the fish, but sharing the fish with our friends and family and enjoying it fresh together. It, 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 it brings the community together. And I'm just glad we get to do this. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure you hit that like button and subscribe. And please tell your friends about us. The more people that see our videos, the better for all of us worldwide. Thank you guys, stay safe, God bless.